We have some new information coming in tonight about what was behind the deadly attack in Montgomery County. A man is charged with murdering his wife after police tell us he ran her over multiple times last week. And tonight, court documents are giving us the first insight into a potential motive. Our Shamari Stone has more tonight, plus reaction from people who knew the couple. I'm outside the suspect's beer and wine shop located near Whedon Mall. Customers tell me they're in complete disbelief. Some have actually walked here to the beer and wine shop and dropped off flowers as a memorial to pay tribute. 59-year-old Hamanshu Magalal Tana co-owned Whedon Park Beer and Wine with his wife Alka. Montgomery County police say he intentionally killed her with his SUV. The couple's beer and wine store is closed. Customers are stunned. I usually come in here, he's always quiet, just looking around. I'm totally shocked. Can you describe the relationship of the couple? They seem fine to me. I mean, you know, she was sweet. He was a little bit mean. According to court documents, Hamanshu Maganal Tana told police he and his wife of 40 years were having financial problems at the store. He drove her to the Capital One Bank on New Hampshire Avenue last Friday. She walked inside, finished a transaction, and then police say Hamanshu ran her over and killed her. He then slammed into a pillar, hit her again, and crashed into a light pole. Officers arrested him. Hamanshu also allegedly told detectives that he noticed money missing from the $200,000 in cash that he kept inside their home. He allegedly told detectives that he believed that his wife was spending it without giving an explanation of what she purchased. Can't believe it. <laughs> it's, it's shocking. This man lives next door. He says the couple was quiet. Did they ever indicate that they were having financial problems? <laughs> no. The suspect is being charged with first degree murder. He's in jail, being held without bond. I'm Shamari Stone, News 4.